All right, what's happening, fam? LAR movement still moving. Book is entitled Lessons from a Non-Custodial Father at Amazon Kindle and Create Space. Uh, a link will be in the description box below, as usual. Another controversial video. This video is entitled The Criminal Coons. Oh, yeah. We about to get into it. So, I was on, on O'Shea Duke Jackson's hangout a couple of days ago. Asking a brother, you know, are the criminals in our community considered coons? He was tap dancing. I was on O'Shea's hangout tonight, um, and Jay Miller brought it up that I that he was watching it that night. So I'm about to do it. First and foremost, go subscribe to Jay Miller's channels if you're watching this and you're not subscribed. ABL's on tonight. Go watch ABL. Like. Donate, uh, um, subscribe, um, if you're not already. Uh, Steve the Dean's on tonight. I don't know if he's still on at the moment, but if not, like the video if he is. Like, subscribe, do your thing. Um, Dynast, um, O'Shea, of course. Solo, let's do all the shout outs. Uh, let's get it. Now, criminals are coons in our community. And all you criminal-minded people are coons. You like to talk about the, the Republicans, you know. That we're going to talk about Ben Carson. We're going to talk about um, Omarosa, right? We're going to talk about, you know, all the people who don't stand up, you know, for, for our, us as black people. But we want to defend criminals. And they're coons. I'm going to tell you why. You know, we say coons always bow down to white people. That's what criminals do, right? See, the, the same criminal that a shoot up the block goes in a white neighborhood. And I'm going to dress up, sir. I'm not a thug anymore. I, I want to talk like this. I'm talking like Kanye West when you see him out with the Kardashians. You want to make fun of Kanye West for talking like that. But your criminal mind at home. I'm just playing the game. No, nah, I want to hear that. You're a coon. You're a coon. You shoot up. The, you see your own people. You shoot up the block. You ready to ride on your own people. You see some white people doing something. Your nuts shrivel up. You ain't. You know. You ain't. What, what up, cuz? What up, blood? You ain't doing all that. You a coon. Because soon as some white people up, you straighten up. Hi, sir. Hello, ma'am. I was a criminal with those black people, but now I'm Carlton. You're a coon. And all you people that sympathize and, oh, those brothers got this, y'all. Y'all coon sympathizers. Yeah. Yeah, you are. You talk about, you know, the Republicans, the conservatives, the sellouts, but you don't talk about your criminal coons. You don't talk about them, right? What's the problem? Why, why, why are you not bringing them up? Hmm? You know, brothers are locked up for nonviolent drug offenses. True. Brothers not getting are getting more time than white people for the same offenses. True. Brothers get exonerated more than anybody because brothers get lied on more than anybody. True. But here's the problem. If your ass is in the in the crime and you in the underworld. You know what come with the life. So who should feel sorry? For? Why are people feeling sorry for you? Huh? If you a thug on the black side of town, how come you the white man's bitch when you go on the re-up? How come, you know, that ran off on the plug? Why? I ran off. Bullshit, you ain't ran off on the white plug, did you? Did you? No, you ain't ran off on that plug. You got all first 48 on the white plug, did you? Sir, can I get some more of that dope, sir? Please, sir. I'm, I'm trying to, you know. Yeah. And all y'all people who, you know, these these criminals, they protect us. They are hard. They are masculine. Well, how come they the errand boy of white people, but then you say that they smart, that they stand up, that they A1, that they masculine, that they alpha. Because they only standing up to your black ass. They only running over your black ass. 
They ain't going to Lily White Lane on that shit. Because they ain't got the heart. I respect black people who decide not to live in the hood no more and are surrounded by, by various groups of other people. And those other groups know I ain't messing with that dude or that woman. She's obviously out here. She ain't for that bullshit. I'm not even going to try to walk up to, to him or her and try to be on that, you know, rah-rah stuff. Because they actually whip my ass and can afford a lawyer. Or if they can't afford a lawyer, they'll still whip my ass because they ain't out here for that shit. But y'all... Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, I was making fun of brothers at the mall. Shopping. You go shoplift in your community, you know. You go steal out the corner store, the other store. You you go hustle somebody, you know. But even even the malls that's in predominantly black areas, you go there and act a fool with it. But you ain't gonna go. We in the white mall. Yes, boss. I'm a that's a Oz got sense, boss. I, I was not gonna I was not gonna do what I did in the black mall, boss. I, I, I was gonna pull my pants up, boss, because it says it's on the sides. But in is in my balls, I was not gonna pull up my pants. I don't give a fuck what these people say in that black mall. I'm gonna do what the fuck I want. Go to the white mall, mm -hmm. tighten up my belt, sir. Criminal ass coon. Yeah, uh huh. You know, you guys. You know, when it comes to just being disruptive and dysfunctional. Are you out there banging your music in the hood? 1, 12, 1, 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. Clock in the morning. <clears throat> I don't give a damn. Wake up everybody on the block. Drop your little suburban girlfriend off. Turn that, I'm going to turn that shit down, Guinevere. Yeah, I don't want to disrespect the community. My little angel. You're fucking cool. You say, you know, you keep the code. Some of y'all keep the code, street code, real, you know. Y'all you know, ain't snitching for y'all who in the game and all that and don't snitch and take your charges or don't take your charges and move on. I ain't got nothing to say to you. I ain't saying nothing to you because you know what it is. But you other cats who like telling, you tell on brothers, but you don't tell on them others. Because you know why? Because you a coon. You ain't going to tell on the white plug, the Asian plug, the Hispanic plug, the Arab plug, but you're telling on the black one, criminal coons. You know? But, you know, we need to make the black community better. You keep co-signing these coons. Them guys ain't coons bullshit, they not. We've been listening to a soundtrack of how to kill each other for the last 30 years. But people telling you to kill your own fellow brother, not a coon to you. Are you a coon? Let me ask you this. When you go to a, 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 a rap concert and the artist is on the stage and you are in the crowd and all these other people of other races are in the crowd and y'all, do you want to say, kill that nigga? And everybody go, do you want to say, kill that nigga? Are you not a coon too? Because you playing, they playing criminal minded music. And, you know, playing in the racism at the same time. And you playing in the, because it got a beat, dog. It got a beat, dog. That, it, the beat be jamming, dog. It got a hook, dog. 5, 10, 20,000 people. Getting to say nigga all for free because it got a beat, dog. But because we said, sell some dope to these nigga, sell some dope to these nigga. But that's not cooning, that's not cool music. You're not a cool ass fan for watching. You're not a you, 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 you're not selling out because we selling out stadiums. I don't want to hear that. Bullshit. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I'm selling out. I, I, I'm down for the cause. What cause? See, a lot of y'all don't want to admit, you know, 
the, the, the political coons you want to admit, you know, the drug addicts in the community, oh, we got to feel for them. They tearing down the community too. They robbing and stealing just to get a hit. Ain't they coons? They destroying the black community. Aren't they coons? Alcoholics, coons, right? Weed heads, coons, right? What's wrong with a little weed? What's wrong with a little weed head mentality that be fucking up the hood? That all y'all want to play into? You know? Because a lot of you weed heads out here, let's be real. The vast majority of you drug addicts, weed heads, and alcoholics in the hood, y'all don't fucking have your own place to stay. Y'all living with somebody. That's why your ass is smoking in your cars and, and drinking in your cars and riding around playing music loud because you don't have no responsibility because you spent all your fucking money getting high and drunk. You wasting your life away for a buzz. And you want to get people to excuse, man, it's just a little weed, it's just a little drink. We just trying to have fun. Have fun. Okay, well, since you're having so much fun, put something on the motherfucking rent, on the lights. On the gas, on the water. Why are you out here buying that bullshit? Because you're dragging your family down because they got to pay for your necessities while you want to get high. Ain't that some cool shit? All you people, let me hold a little something and I'm going to get right back at you. And then you run off and you smile and you on the internet, you know, fronting and stunting, you know, with all the shit you bought while you owe other people money. And then you walking around like, ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't that some cool shit? Disrespecting your own like that who was looking out for you. Just saying. You know. <laughs> All you people who want to, how can I say this? You want to have kids but you don't want to take care of them. And then you want to blame the community. Ain't that some cool shit? And you let, I'm gonna let, and let these white folks teach your kids because you don't want to when you bring them home. Ain't that some cool shit? For all you people who Want to keep your child away from one parent or one or one other whole side of the family because you want to be controlled, but you let everybody else who's not black take care and watch them kids. Ain't that some coon shit? But we don't want to talk about that, huh? Because all of y'all, you know, don't want to play that. Your parents who, you, your daughters grew up to be strippers. Ain't you a coon parent? Because you knew if you didn't raise your girl right, she was going to be on the pole, right? All your parents who, your kids grew up to be in them streets. Ain't you, a, your sons wound up in them streets. Ain't you a coon parent? All your parents who think, who kids believe it's either athletics, entertainment, or bust. Because you ain't teaching them nothing. Ain't you a coon for putting them in that position? I'm just saying. You know what? Before I say something that hurt somebody feelings, we out.